um, I feel like I know you guys pretty well. I feel like I know you guys not only just from tonight, but I feel like we've, we've, we've been here so much now that I feel like whenever I go to Houston, I'm like, I get, I know, I know kind of who's here. I feel like many of you have been with me from the very, very beginning. Which is great. I see familiar faces. It's like, you know, you see me go through puberty, basically. It's a very strange, very awkward, very awkward thing. But I feel, I feel like maybe some of you uh, are seeing me for the very, very first time tonight, in which case, like, welcome. to you when you leave the venue, Woo! and your souls now belong to me, free Kool-Aid. So welcome, I feel like maybe, uh, uh, maybe some of you were dragged here tonight by your wife, or your girlfriend, or your, come on, I don't know, it's possible. I heard a guy go, yeah, yeah. I like seeing the men in the audience, it's good, yes, yes. Robocop will protect you. You're getting lucky tonight. <laughs> Gentlemen, it's brownie points. It's great. It's, this is two hours of a very long evening, if you know what I mean. So have a good time. Um, and uh, and so one of the fun things to do when you hit a city like, you know, as vibrant and wonderful as Houston is, is that a little Q&A, we ask you guys to send in some questions. I have not seen any of them because I think it's just way more interesting for me that way at least. But a few of them are on this uh, white card here in my hand. And if I say your name and your seat number, please scream as loud as you possibly can so I know where you are in this cavernous place. Uh, I haven't even started, but thank you. That's good. That's good. I like that. Section 119, row 11, seats 4 and 5, Lance Edition. That sounds like a like a math teacher slash weatherman. That's awesome. Is Lance here? Where's Lance? Oh, cool. Hey, Lance, how are you? Sir, sir there's a gentleman there, right? Yes, hey, Lance. Hey, Lance. <laughs> I heard so many girls screaming that I just, I figured you have like groupies around you or something. You've got like Lance has his fan base. Oh, he's right there. He's right there. <laughs> Lance Edition. Is that your real last name, Edition? Oh, Additon. They put Edition on you. I don't know. I'm going to subtract a few letters from this name here. Okay. All right. When you when you sign your first record deal, you can change it to edition. It's it's way catchier. Than, than for sure. um, oh no, I don't mean that in a bad way. I mean, most names aren't catchy. Groban. I mean, come on. <laughs> That's like the worst last name ever for a singer. I should have made it like Josh uh, uh, Bottom Voice or something. I don't know. I used to... I'm a private pilot, but that's awesome. I would like to ask you, what has been your scariest moment while learning to fly? Mine was when my door came open at 800 feet on my first lesson. <laughs> oh, man, that sucks. <laughs> you didn't have a parachute or anything? You were just like, you were just like, well, that happened. <laughs> um, did you then immediately land? I would imagine so. You're not gonna like sightsee at that point. You're gonna be like. Well, it's such nice weather out. I guess we'll just continue doing this. Um, I am getting my pilot's license. I've been, I've been training now for, for a couple months. It's really, really a lot of fun. It is a great Woo! I can't even fathom my first lesson that it happened to me. Uh, but at least it was 800 feet, not 8,000 feet. Uh, so you still live. But um, my, my experience was when we, we pulled some major G's. Like he wanted me to see, he wanted me to see how uh, what the plane could handle. So he's like, yeah, you see that keychain right there? I want you to make, I want you to hit the ceiling. So he had us like dive down and then pull back up, and I almost threw up. But I didn't. Uh, and uh, man, okay. So when I when I get my my my, I'm gonna change my last name to Edition when I get my pilot's license. <laughs> Captain Edition at your service. <laughs> it's like something from Schoolhouse Rock. <laughs> Captain Edition, won't you <laughs> Alec Lawrence, floor K, row four, seat seven. That sounds expensive. Alec Lawrence. Where's Alec? Is that you? Hey, Alec. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Is that him? Is that you? It's you. Okay, I think I need another fan base. He's right here. It's your day off. No, it most certainly isn't. 
It's your day off. Your day off. Okay, it's your day off. You can travel to any place on Earth to eat your favorite meal. Where are you going and what are you eating? Oh, I'm going to Tokyo and I'm going to eat. I'm going to dream of sushi with Jiro. I don't know if you guys have seen that documentary, but that's like that's my jam. I, I want to get that egg dish where they spend like 10 years working on how to make the perfect sweet omelet. And if it's not crispy on the on the sides, they throw it to the octopus tank. I don't know. It's uh, it's amazing. So is that where we're going? We're going. You're coming with me. We're gonna go see Jiro. Oh, no. I'm so sorry. Sometimes I think I'm Oprah and I get really confused. <laughs> I realize I want to like give things to you and then I realize we just don't have the budget for that. I'm so sorry. And you're going to Japan. You're going to Japan. All right, I'm gonna need some help with this uh, last name. Nika Fandanuvon. I can tell by the crickets that I said that absolutely wrong, but truly I've got to be a little bit close. Nika, find the new home. Find the new home. Find the new home. Section 126, row B and C14. Paging, find the new home, find the new home. Your question is being asked. Oh my god. All right, well. Hi, Josh. I'm 22, and my fiance Russell is 23. Apparently, you're not here tonight, so you're missing out. Aww. We're getting married next July 4th. Maybe you decided to do it early. I don't know. <laughs> he used to always sing your songs to me through the landline until the battery ran out. Although you're not married, what piece of advice would you give us?